Hello everyone, this is Dance Bars, and welcome back to Let's Play Crusader Kings 2 Way of Life. Uh, right at the end of the last video, right when the timer was getting off, my aunt finally had a son. And of course, it's a bastard. My cousin is a Claus, apparently. Um, so he is of my dynasty, which means I have to name him but I always have to name people because the way we're doing this is the firstborn child always has to be named Nicholas but because he is a bastard he doesn't get to be called Nicholas no he's just Nick all right Nick and see, now he is of House Rod. So we are not choosing him. Sorry, you are not my heir. My aunt is still my heir, because we're not choosing you. You're not of my dynasty. Fuck you, Nick Rod. <laughs> God, I hate you. I seriously, I... My aunt... Well, first of all, first my mother was being a total pain when it came to marriages for my aunt. So that was frustrating. And now my aunt is being totally frustrating also. I mean, first of all, she has herpes. She's got the herp. She's got lover's pox. Ugh. And she's an adulteress. Osor is no longer marshal for Duchess Nicola. Oh no. What are we going to do? We need a new marshal. Uh, this guy seems pretty good. Arnkiel? Yeah. Research some military tech, please, because we are not at war. And I don't expect to be at war anytime soon, hopefully. This guy needs to die, though. Uh, Georgios has arrived in your court. Why? Eudoxios has arrived in your court. Why? Nifon has arrived in your court. Why? Well, first of all, guys... You all need to convert. Okay? Search court. Men. Uh, any. I don't know if they're married or not. Ruler, no. Uh, not my religion. So, Nifon, I'm telling him to convert, right? Georgios, you also need to convert. You're not going to. Eudoxios, you need to convert. You will. Georgios is going to be a problem, that's for sure. I will convert. I will convert. Nice! So now we have a few better people now. Like, Eudoxios is a way better spy master. Um. We got Georgios, Nifon, eh. It's Eudoxios, that's the better guy. We're gonna replace our spy master with Eudoxios. And we're gonna have him scheme. Get those plots exposed. Because I'm a child, and I'm under no illusions that people are not trying to take my land. I already know someone's trying to take my land. This guy. This guy needs to die. Can't kill him, though, which sucks. Anyway. We are still <laughs> waiting for something to happen. I'm zealous again, and it's going to go right away, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> that happened last time. Same exact thing happened last time. Ugh. Okay, so my, my prince is now an adult. He's not great. He's kind of good with combat. Um, I don't know what 14 is. Is 14 masterful or is that just good? Not sure, but he has some pretty good sorts of things. Um, probably the flat terrain expert won't work too well in Iceland because I think it's mostly mountains. But he is patient, which is good. Patient is good. 
and I can marry him in five years. Hopefully he will wait and I won't have any bastard children to deal with. Hopefully, anyway. Regencies blow hard, you guys. They blow so very hard. In fact, I'm probably so done with this Regency, I think this might be the last video I'm recording today. Because just, uh, the Regency- being in a Regency sucks all the enjoyment <laughs> out of the game. Because you can't do anything, you can't- you don't have any plots, you don't have any focuses, you don't have any ambitions. You're just waiting, and waiting, and waiting, and waiting. Osor is no longer Chancellor. Leader of Osor's host. Where the fuck are you going? <laughs> God damn it. He's attacking Navara. Well, good luck with that, dude. Great, and you're, and you're gonna be dragging my, <laughs> my aunt with you? Oh, God damn it. Alright, whatever. <laughs> you go do that. Have fun. Been appointed as your regent. Who's my regent now? This guy. Well, could have worse regents, that's for sure. Do you want to get married? I think he wants to get married. Arrange marriage with this dummy. No. <laughs> <clears throat> Nah, if he wants to get married, he can get married himself. Well, now I gotta go see what this guy's doing. Is he down there fighting? Where is he? Leading troops off the coast of Iceland. We'll arrive in Feroia. So... He's really doing it. I doubt he'll do anything. He'll probably end up in prison and dead. And then my poor, poor aunt will... We'll have to find another matrilineal marriage for her. This d Damn you, Osir. You just fucked everything up. And how do you even have a claim? You're Norwegian. Oh, your mother... That's your mother. Oh, okay. Now I get it. I was wondering where that lady from Navarra showed up. Um, sadly, I can't see what's happening down here. Well, I could if I used cheat codes, but I don't want it. <laughs> I don't think this is Iron Man. Is it? No, it's not. Okay. I just don't. I don't remember what the code to turn it off is. Why does she hate me now? Yes, you're a title claimant, but you're my fucking heir. Why do you hate me so much, you stupid fucking bitch? I hope your husband dies. <laughs> oh god. Uh, Osir's host on Navara. And they're also fighting a Castilian claim on Navara. Well, good luck with that. I'm sure it will work out great. How many men do you even have? <laughs> yeah, 1,700 men. That'll... That'll be perfect. At least that's his only claim. But this bastard is now going to get a claim on my land. He's not an heir, right? No, not him. Where is he? This guy. No, he's like... Where is he? He's down here. He's not inheriting Jack. Alright, that's good. How's your war coming, guys? 
Zero percent. Cool. I would help you, but you know. No, I wouldn't help you. You're off gallivanting, doing your own thing. I'm not gonna do anything for you. Mm. Let me see. I think. Is it. Is it this? Fog of War turned off? Uh, no? There we go. Alright, so we can now just, just take a look at Osser's host. Money has been disappearing from the treasury, I suspect my regent, but there's no proof. God damn it, regent. At least you're stressed. Maybe I should get him married. What about her? Would you want her? Nope. What about her? Would you want her? He would. Mm. Nah. <laughs> Does he have a claim on, like, all of Navarra? On the Kingdom of Navarra? Or just the County of Navarra? Oh, nope. The King of Navarra. Right. Hmm. Well, they aren't going after him, so for now it seems like. <laughs> oh my god, if he wins. If he wins, he becomes King of Navarra, my aunt becomes Queen of Navarra in a matrilineal marriage, and any children they. Oh. <laughs> oh god. In some ways, I want them to win, because then my dynasty will control Navarra. Potentially. Which is a... a um, an outcome I never saw happening with this game. Two percent in favor of the King of Navarra. Oh, because they haven't done anything. They haven't conquered anything, they haven't been in a battle anywhere. My mission to the king has been a success. Good. Okay, so he likes me a little bit more. That's good. It's good to be liked. I'm just watching the <laughs> this this little war going on. Sorry if this is really boring, but there's really nothing else I can do. I'm just watching to see if maybe my uncle becomes King of Navarra. A very unlikely outcome, but you never know. Weirder things have happened, right? But if he doesn't actually end up sieging a territory, it's gonna just end, right? Because that's how it works, right? Now. If you don't get any war score, the the war just automatically ends after a certain number of time. Pope Nicholas has died and been succeeded by Pope Pelagius. That's a cool name. Hmm. I don't think they have enough men to siege. Do they? <laughs> Become humble. Well, no, they should. It's 1,000 men at the garrison. They have 16... They have, like, 1,700, so... Oh, God. Why is he dead now? A uh, period of illness. Fuck off, people. Seriously. Here, Gildebride, you. Go scheme. Can't wait to see what horrible person is my regent now. Oh, my spy master. But he likes me, so it's a bit better. I'll even have him get married. 
whatever. What do I care? If it gets him to like me more, then... Good. See? Now he likes me even more. So hopefully he won't try any funny business. I won't stand for any funny business. Although there's really not much I can do if he does do any funny business. And she is still not having any kids with him. So... Ugh. And this war is going nowhere. 13% favor the king. How many soldiers do they have? 1,500 right now. So they're about equal in size. Oh! So Asso's host did take Navarra. So they're not in... So now they have war score in their favor. And they're going to attack these guys. Who's this guy? Who's he? Dionysia. She's a clubfoot. Well, we're gonna demand your... Nope, can't demand your thing. Alright. That's fine, I guess. <laughs> huh. If they pull this off, that'd be crazy. Right? Like, that'd be... Uh-oh. Will they... Oh, they did. 40% in favor of Osor's host. That's nuts. This is insane. This is going insane territory right now, right? Like, this shouldn't be happening. <laughs> A host from Iceland should not be taking over Navarra right now. 40%. They're, I think they're starting to run out of steam, though. They're down to 957. I think they're gonna... Yeah, they're starting to run out of steam. They've been going... They, they were pressing too hard. It's over. The host... The host has been broken, essentially, at this point. And where are they gonna go now? The Bay of Biscay. Where are they headed, I wonder? Are they headed back to... <laughs> Are they coming back to court? <laughs> you lost, people. Yeah, they're going back to Iceland. They're coming back home because they lost. And they lost... badly. And they know they lost badly. They've come to lick their wounds. And because of that, we're going to turn off Fog of War. We're going to put it back on, I mean. I don't need to see everything else. Uh, Titer Isflisferson claims that he would be a better marshal than Arkiel and petitions that he should be given the title of marshal. Uh, Titer, he's ten. My marshal is nine. Hmm. You got a point, Titer. Because he is wounded. He's my new marshal. And we'll do military tech. Where are you going? You didn't regain any of your soldiers. Okay, whatever. You know what? Whatever. You go. <laughs> you go and be a failure. Because that's what you're going to be. The assassins spread to Syria. The Hashashin, the elusive order of assassins, have expanded their influence into Syria. A branch of their sect has established itself in the mountain fortress of Mysiaf, from where they control the surrounding countryside. All across the Holy Land, the assassins are now hunting those they see as obstacles to their obscure plans. So where are the Hashashin? So they're there, and they're there. Okay. 
What is this war score for this one? It's still 40% in favor, but it's gonna... Oh, and there's my timer. So, until next time, folks, this has been Dance Bars, and this has been one really interesting set of videos with this Regency. I'm so sorry. It's a Regency. I am so terribly sorry. Once I finish through the Regency, I'll make sure to put annotations on the videos if you want to skip the Regency because, oh my god, <laughs> it's such a pain. Anyway, until next time, this has been Dance Farce. Like, comment, subscribe. Leave me any questions if you want to know anything. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, or Tumblr. Links are down below. I'm slurring. And until next time, bye!